I used to have a hard time with the concept of letting go of the past because I used to think people were saying to forget about memories altogether. And uh, I know that seems kind of silly and it's kind of dumb that it took me, you know, till I'm 40 to really realize that, but hey, at least I realize it. Some people never do. But, uh, yeah, um, letting go of the negativity of the past uh, is pretty important to do. Um, it's also allowed me to... Well, I mean, I think the biggest, pro the biggest problem is that I've, for so long that I felt that To focus on the things that are negative and dark are to focus on the things that are real and deep. And that's just so emo, really. It, it is. But I had kind of felt that way for a long time. And there's, there's so much beauty in the world. There's so many just great things out there um i mean the our accomplishments the things that we've been able to achieve the uh just just our ability to, to empathize and think about other people and our, our ability to to think to to look at our similarities as well as look at our differences um just just all these amazing things and you just when you're looking at everything from a from a perspective of trying to look at the dark side of everything you miss all the good stuff you miss it and i was i was missing so much so many changes lately uh and i finally got past the, some of the elements of my brother you know with my brother always trying to He, he he pushes the this these he pushes these guidelines or something as as if you're you're supposed to follow this ideal for for what a guy is supposed to be uh that it's you're supposed to be some sort of badass or try to be a badass and try to always prove that you're manlier or something and it's just it's so stupid to me and once I really saw him for what he, for what he's doing, it's like okay, that's kind of laughable, but whatever. That's that's his thing. That's what he thinks he should be, and and that's fine. Um, I mean, I people know I've I've had my share of trying to have a uh, a, a gruff sort of appearance, but it's it's not about this whole. St stick out your chest and be some badass type of thing. That's not what it's about. But, you know, there's just... And, uh... You know, just realizing, you know, whatever it is, I need to just be myself. If people don't like it, that's that's their thing, you know? If people like me, cool. If people don't, hey, whatever, you know, I'm just gonna keep being myself. Um... God, just so many more positive things to just view in the world. I don't know. No, that doesn't, there's not more of that. I'm not wording things well, but it's just, it's like a different world. It's like a different world. How could I be so negative and want to focus on things so negative? Why did I want to be angry all the time? Why did I want that? Why did I think that was something to strive for? The biggest thing that got me out of this was uh, a seven-hour conversation, uh, a video conversation with uh, someone on Skype. Uh, she is the most depressing, dark, uh, emo person I have ever met. Uh, she's agoraphobic, totally agoraphobic. I've, I've known her in Second Life for a few years. She... Uh, Whenever I talked to her in text, it was just, always just dark stuff. And when I never I get to hear her talk, uh, voice in Second Life, uh, she was always like, 
she'd have some song in the background that you could, couldn't hear loud enough to hear the song, but you could hear her humming totally incomprehensibly. It was just, you know, whatever it was, it was just like, wow, that's not easy. It doesn't even resemble the song at all, but, you know, whatever. And I'd hear that, and that's mainly what I knew of her. Uh, you know, Miss Wednesday Adams or Totally Drunk. Well, so I talked I talk to her for seven hours uh, the whole time, trying to, you know, tell her she's, you know, she's, she's, there's, she's not a bad person. Uh, you can think dark things and still be a good person, you know, as long as you're not actually doing bad things, and, you know, things are fine. And I won't go into detail about some of the very strange uh, things that she thought. Uh, I, I, it's it's just very negative, um, but uh, after those seven hours, uh, I find out that, that you know she's cutting her arm with a Zacto, Zacto knife. Uh, uh, this side of her arm, not this side, but this side of her arm, on cam, blood spilling down, and I'm just supposed to be fine with it because she she's a cutter or whatever, and it's just you know I didn't necessarily think about that at the time, but I told her you know. Um, you better be able to call me tomorrow or something so I know you're still alive. Please don't do something that you 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 can't undo. Um, I can't look at this. Um, you you're a good person. Just just I can't look at this. Goodbye. And uh, and then I cried for about twenty minutes uh, after that because I just. But it 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 was a wake up call for me because I I I know that I have thought. Very, you know, I've been down a negative road and down a road of being angry all the time and just, I mean, she isn't angry, but it just was still a big wake-up call. It's like, I can't allow myself to ever, ever become something like that. And, uh, so, I, uh, really started doing some self-evaluating and made some changes and, uh, I really feel I'm a better person for it and... Like I said, it's such a different world now. Such a different world for me. The world is a beautiful place if you look for it. You gotta be looking for it. You gotta be receptive to it. You should promote what you love instead of bashing what you hate. And that's... A philosophy I'm trying to take now and uh, maybe it doesn't make very interesting YouTube videos but uh, I sure feel better about myself over it I uh, I I'm sure I'll still be angry once in a while but uh, I just can't see that being my main squeeze my main thing that I push forth all the time and I know I've said it a few times in these last videos but I just I I, I feel like a better person I feel I feel better about the world. Anyway. 